Yu-Gi-Oh! Abridged. We're about half as popular as Team Four Star. Hmm. Oh, sorry I took so long, guys. Stupid Mass Effect elevator technology. Mokuba, thank goodness. We have to get Bakura to safety. You gotta land the blimp, man. Seto says landing is out of the question. And he also said to direct all complaints towards somebody who gives a crap. Hey, open this damn door right now, Kaiba. Whoa, stop it, Joey. You're making a huge mistake. Whoa. Oh, yeah, what's the waste? that could happen. Yeah, 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 yeah. Punch me again and find out. Please. <laughs> Due to the near-fatal wounding of one of our contestants, there will be a 20-minute delay before the start of the next round. This song always makes me think of Mom. These are going straight onto my nipples. Ha <laughs> ha! Ice cube fetish. You people are wasting your time. This blimp stays in the air and that's final. But Bakora could die if we don't get him to a hospital. That's a sacrifice I'm willing to make. Mr. Kaiba, please, show some compassion. Show some what now? Hey, don't talk like... Hey, don't talk Talk like that to Joey's severely spankable sister. Poor kid. Tell me, Serenity, what's it like to be related to a furry? Yeah, Ixnay on the Uri fake Kaiba. Sorry, what's a furry? Yeah, uh, um, uh, he didn't say furry, he said, uh, Fury, as in the kind I have. You know, Brooklyn Fury! Sorry, didn't quite catch that. Did you just say Brooklyn Furry? Oh, go yiff yourself, Kaiba. Whatever that means. Yeah, Google image it, you jake! Hey, um, Serenity, uh, you know, I was just wondering, uh, after this tournament's over, would you ever consider maybe, um... Hey, Serenity, how'd you like to fly Air Devlin? Look, Tristan, that son of a bitch is stealing your woman! You know what you must do! Make him disappear! <laughs> oh, faithful trading cards. You're the only real friends I have. Except for you, Burfamet. You're kind of an asshole. What's that, Dark Magician Girl? You wanna make out? Well, I'd be happy to- Holy jeez! How long have you been standing there? Long enough! Duke, I know you put a spell on Serenity so she would fall in love with you, and I want the antidote! Sorry, Tristan. I can't help it if the ladies love to play with my dice. You just brought Sexy back for the last time, witch! Kick his ass, Tristan! Yeah! Really f*** him up good! Where is your broomstick now? Uh, hey, stop uh, dodging! Uh, 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 my voice gives me super. Uh, I'm tripping! Oh, no. Tripping! Ah! Tripping! Oh, no! Cody! Or maybe it was Zack! Hey, you're that guy from Duelist Kingdom. Yagshimash! My name is Shadi. I am here to help with very much saving of the world. And maybe when I am finished, we go find woman and have sexy time. I suppose it could be worse. You could be acting like Bruno. High five! Oh my god, we're gonna die! Duke, stop screaming! I can't believe I'm actually gonna die in a show about f***ing card games! Duke, please, it's pointless. After all, in space, no one can hear you scream. So what do you do exactly? Just show up at the end of every season and explain the plot? I have many roles in your story, little Jew boy. One is to provide you with backstory. But my first and foremost task is to protect the fourth wall. Great success. The fourth wall? What's that? Without the fourth wall, the balance of the universe would be turned upside down. Man would become like the animal. Animal would become like the dirt. And dirt would become like the Jew. You know, Shadi, you're kind of a buzzkill. Duke, no matter what... What happens to us? I want you to remember one thing. In another few hours, the sun will rise. What the fuck does that mean? I don't know, but it's true. Your old friend Maximilian Pegasus once came dangerously close to breaking the fourth wall when he visited my homeland of Egypt. Like many people from America, he was seeking to exploit our third world country. Happy time. 
this music is so unfabulous. Don't you have anything by ABBA? For years, Pegasus had been searching for the Pharaoh's tomb. It was like movie film Indiana Jones and the Kingdom of the Crystal Skull made by deceitful Jewish filmmaker Steven Spielberg. Only not quite so disappointed. At this rate, we're never going to find the Pharaoh's tomb. If you promise to rid my land of the Jew, I will show you where it is hidden. Well, when we first met, you took out my eyeball and replaced it with a cursed artifact. But I'm sure this time you have only the best intentions for me. Yes, I screw you up good. Uh, I can't hold on, Duke. No, I can feel no, my hand no, slipping. Let go, uh, dude. I can no. feel it. Oh, I can't let go. Christ. Oh, no. no this is terrible. We're going to die. Again. <laughs> oh, again. Again. Oh, again. Jesus. Hey, Duke. What? Just kidding. Hey, look! I can see my house from here! Hi, Mom! Hi, Dad! Hey, Tristan! When Pegasus saw the Pharaoh's tomb, he was so excited! He was like woman after being given shiny new cage to sleep in! Jesus! This is one of the most important historical finds in centuries! I'm turning this shit into trading cards! But then, something go horribly wrong! <laughs> yeah! Everybody involved with the production of the Egyptian god cards was killed. What? Even Chad from accounting? Ah! Especially Chad from accounting. And so, Pegasus decided to design the cards himself. It's like I'm stealing from the Egyptian god's deviant art account. <laughs> I'm so naughty, naughty, naughty. But that very night, he was plagued with nightmares that make his clam shrink like tiny mouse. In the name of all that is camp, what is happening? Where am I? What you are seeing is the future. If you allow the Egyptian god cards to fall into the wrong hands, then the fourth wall will be destroyed and the world as we know it will cease to be. If you knew this would happen, then why did you take me to the pharaoh's tomb in the first place? I am how you say kind of a dick. What dark forces have I unleashed? Dirty hands! Dirty, dirty hands! And so, with the help of gypsy woman Ishizu, Pegasus hid the Egyptian god cards where even the craftiest of Jews would not be able to find them. Yeah, because obviously he couldn't have just destroyed them or anything. The power of the cards was too great for them to be simply destroyed. Right, so the power of the Egyptian gods prevented a guy from tearing up a few pieces of paper that he painted himself. Sure, okay. As I was saying... <coughs> Bullcrap! <coughs> what? What? 96 Duel Monsters cards on the wall, 96 Duel Monsters cards! Take one down, trade it around. 95 Duel Monsters cards on the wall. 95 Duel Monsters cards on the wall. 95 Duel Monsters cards. Duke, you're not singing. You must beware, Yugi. The Egyptian gods were never meant to be controlled by mortal men. That is why you alone, as the chosen one, must possess the god cards. So that the fourth wall will forever stand. So let me get this straight. According to this show, the Egyptian gods are real. Yes. But doesn't that mean all other religions are wrong? And the hokey ancient Egypt religion is is the only real one? Yes! Huh. Didn't see that one coming. I did! I can't believe it! We're being rescued by a stranger wearing a turban! And then they disappeared. This can only mean one thing! I have a fairy godmother! Is she a MILF? She kinda looks like Piccolo. Yeah, that's a MILF. <laughs> your stone and f you anyway tell me shoddy is it true our show's going to be cancelled after season two never fear tiny jew i am sure the good people at four kids will renew you for another season Whew. well that's a load off my mind not